So ADHD is a behavioral disorder. It's diagnosed by behavioral uh, components. It's not, it is not diagnosed by neuropsychological testing. Even though the educational testing service that oversees all of the testing in the United States says that neuropsychological testing needs to be performed in order to determine the impairments from ADHD. It's absolutely not true and I publicly say that I think that that's a discriminatory policy because if you don't have $2,000 in my area, it's 2000 to $2,500, and you can't get psychological testing, does that mean you don't get academic accommodations on LSATs and SATs and GREs and GMATs and et cetera, et cetera, et cetera? Now, what does get determined on psychological testing is intelligence, learning disabilities, and executive function. And you've heard a lot about executive function this morning by, uh, by Tim, and let's just talk about executive function so we can put everybody on the same page. This is executive function. Response inhibition, the ability to not respond and to give some forethought. Working memory, the ability to hold information in your head as you manipulate and make decisions. Set shifting, the ability to move smoothly from the end of one task onto the next task to the next task. Interference control is not being distracted by noises and things going on around you. So not everybody with ADHD has executive function. But wait a minute, Dr. Goodman, I thought that everybody with ADHD has executive dysfunction. How are you making that distinction? If you say executive function operationally based on symptoms, then you'll say that people are disorganized and they can't get things done and they're always late, and that's executive function based on symptoms. If you define executive function based on neuropsychological testing, however, 30 to 50 percent of ADHD individuals have executive function based on neuropsychological testing. Also, you can have executive dysfunction and not have ADHD. So about five, seven percent of the population will have executive dysfunction and not have ADHD.